caught in the act but still on the run, Mexico has released video images showing the moment when drug kingpin Joaquin El Chapo Guzman escaped from a maximum security prison. As CCTV's Frank Contreras reports the images reveal an escape plan carefully conceived. Cell number 20 at Mexico's Altiplano Maximum Security Prison. Until Saturday night, it held the world's most notorious drug lord, Joaquin El Chapo Guzman. The night he escaped, a surveillance camera observed almost every move he made. At one point, Guzman enters the shower area and ducks down toward the floor. Mexico's National Security Commissioner says the privacy wall prevents the camera from showing what he was doing. The reason for the blind spots is to give inmates privacy in the bathroom area and shower. Guzman remains out of sight for nearly half a minute. Then he returns to his bed, sits down and changes his sandals for sturdier walking shoes. And in a fairly calm fashion, he makes his spectacular exit. The underground tunnel Guzman used is elaborate, though tight on space. It's just over one and a half meters high, between 70 and 80 centimeters wide, and has lighting and ventilation. This metal cart was likely used to remove dirt while the tunnel was being built. The drug kingpin used this modified motorcycle to ride toward freedom. About one and a half kilometers long in total, the tunnel ends with this wooden ladder, leading to this house located in a rural area near a military base. A security expert says the escape proves that Guzman's incarceration never stopped the Sinaloa cartel. It's a very big, complex organization that has continued to operate. Chapo was in the jail, but the cartel continued to operate in a regular manner, and it will continue functioning business as usual. Mexican security forces remain on high alert as the search for Joaquin El Chapo Guzman continues. This is the Sinaloa cartel leader's second escape from a maximum security prison. Observers call it a brazen feat that underscores the grim reality that corruption still plagues Mexico's law enforcement system. Frank Contreras, CCTV, Mexico City.